Hello everyone, I'm Rakshit Pai and in this video I'll talk about how we can invest in our 20s. India is relatively a young nation. Our median age is 28.4 years. This means we have a lot of people aged 20 to 30 and trust me, this is the time to start investing. Age 20 to 30 is the time we start our career. It is the time we get into a job and start making money. But as soon as you start earning, you want to spend it all, right? Well, we have our needs and as the income increases, our needs grow bigger. That's where we do mistakes. So in this video, I'll tell you what needs to be done. And if my suggestion sounds practical and doable, then you must subscribe to this channel. Let's get started. Have you ever heard the importance of compounding? It's termed as the eighth wonder of the world because compounding will never cease to impress us. For example, rupees 15,000 investment per month for the next 15 years at 15% ROI will yield you rupees 1 crore. Now here's how the magic happens. Even if you stop investing after your 15th year investment and do nothing, considering a 15% ROI, year after year, you will have something like 9.5 crore rupees in your 30th year of investment. This happened because you gave your investment time to breathe. This is the major benefit of starting investing at a young age. How to start investing in your 20s? First and foremost, concentrate on budgeting. Budgeting is nothing but analyzing your spending pattern. Know what you are earning and see where you are spending and how much you are spending. Once you know how much you earn and what part of it is being spent, you can work on reducing your expenses and concentrate on savings. Remember, saving is the first step to wealth creation. A rule of thumb is that before even considering investing, you must have at least 6 months of your required monthly expenses savings in an emergency fund. Ok, budgeting and saving is done. Now where to invest? Usually we go by age, wherein if you are 20 years old, you must allocate 80% of your investment in risky asset and the balance 20% in safe asset. But this is the wrong approach. Each and every one of us has a different risk profile. You may be in a better situation financially than me. In such a case, you taking risk even at age 80 makes sense. So don't go by age. Instead, invest in those assets that you understand well and allocate accordingly. And when investing, Diversify in assets such as equity, gold, silver, bond, real estate, etc. based on how much of it you understand. If equity is something that you are very familiar with, then that's where your money should be. Think long term. Look, if you are under 30 and not investing for the long term, then I'm sorry to say you are approaching investing entirely wrong. So to summarize, start saving invest wisely and stay invested for the long term. For more information, check the link in the description. That's it for now. Thank you for watching.